Hey y'all, hey y'all, it's your girl Shanika back with another video. Just wanted to come on to clear up um any misunderstanding of the video, the last video that I posted. But yeah, um if I have any new subscribers, thank you for unsubscribing to my channel. I hope y'all enjoy the little bits and pieces of my journey. Um and continue to rock with me but yeah what i need y'all to do is hit that like button um comment subscribe and share you know but to the ones that's already on here hey y'all thank y'all for subscribing also but yeah i want to clear up any other misunderstanding of the last video one i didn't buy my car from that um place Second, I was just going to get my AC fix. Um, I noticed it was a lot of comments talking about, um, oh, you shouldn't have bought your car there, or you shouldn't have took it there, or whatever. I understand mistakes do happen. Um, I mean... It's the way how he carried himself and how he just came out when we was asking questions. He was already being nasty because I noticed a lot of people was commenting that I can't remember a lot, but I remember a lot was saying, um, oh, you shouldn't have took your car there. Oh, you should have took it to BMW. Oh, you should have took it to this place. Oh, you should have took it that place. Yeah, I should have took it to BMW. But it wasn't no little side garage. It was a business. It was actually a business. I didn't know that. Sometimes when you take your cars to places, you don't know that that they're going to mess your car up. Or that's not a good place. Or whatever. BMW, they could have did the same thing. They could have messed it up also. So it's like... Mistakes do happen, but if the man would have came out and told the truth that he must have cut a wire or he must have unplugged something because I took my car somewhere else and the problem that they said it was, it wasn't that problem. So, a lot of people on here had so much to say about a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. I read your comments. I come, I you know comment on some of them but at the end of the day it was a lesson learned and I am taking him to court and he's going to pay this other um, place that's doing my car now he's going to have to find a way to give me that $1,900 that's what he owed me because for one my car was in there for AC how I ended up with electrical problem and that's not even the issue, he said. He claimed that it was an electrical problem, but ain't no way. I never had any problems out of my car when I took it up there. I just took it up there just for an AC. That was it. And next thing you know, I had all these issues with it. I was trying to be nice, but the man was being nasty. They called the police, but either way it goes, it was his fault. This ain't the first time he done it to anybody. So, yeah, I just wanted to come on here and let y'all know. It wasn't just a regular garage shop. or It was actually a, a business that we didn't know that they had so many issues of it until the police told us. You know, it was our mistake because we should have checked into it before we dropped it off but you know it's a lesson learned you know we got we all go through you know stuff that we gotta you gotta live and learn <laughs> that's just life you gotta live and learn from your mistakes and that's what we did we live and learn so let me see where i can set my phone in yeah it was just so many people that had so much to say my bad, y'all. There were so many people that had so much to say. So negative. My bad. But yeah, everybody had so much to say. You know, it's okay. 
it is okay. You can say how you feel. But I hope everybody have a blessed Sunday. Happy Sunday to everybody. I know a lot of people do reset on Sunday. Um, well, my husband, he's getting a haircut right now. And I'm sitting in the car waiting on him. So, yeah. I just wanted to come on here and clear it up. That. <laughs> I went. I never bought my car from that place. Never bought the car from that place. I was just going to get the AC fixed. That's it. Good Lord. Y'all is. who Y'all was eating me up in them comments but it's okay though it's okay because you only see a look you know a few seconds of my life anyway so people will assume assume anything but when you assume you make an ass out of yourself so that's it you know yeah y'all was just trying y'all thought y'all was eating me up but you wasn't because like i say anybody can make a mistake i just took my car to the wrong place that's it to the wrong place to do a simple job you know but it's okay but yeah so i just wanted to let y'all know yeah i went to you know let y'all know the details i said let me get on here to clear this up never bought my car from there i bought my car from a bmw dealership and which i should have took it back to but you know it's okay it's okay. Like I said, listen, learn. So, you know, um, right now, like I said, I'm sitting here waiting on my husband to come out. Um, I guess I'll show y'all what we're going to be doing the rest of the day. We just riding and chilling. So, yeah, I'll be back. Hey y'all, um, I came over here to show y'all, since it's raining, y'all, it's raining, it's been flooding everywhere in certain areas and stuff, so I'm not cooking, today is Sunday, so he's coming to get some Chinese food, he's coming, he's getting Chinese food, and I think, I just want some shrimp and broccoli, and a shrimp roll, and I'm going to Wendy's, and get me some, um, what I'm getting? Some garlic parmesan nuggets I wanna try. So today supposed to be a, 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 a big dinner Sunday. Not today, I'm going home. Watch me get in my bed. Excuse me, take me a shower. Get in my bed and watch some movies and stuff but i'm gonna put in the clip where we was at um yeah that rain came down so fast to the point it was flooding everywhere so i'm gonna put that clip in that um to show y'all how much water that was like coming down if you got a look car and you low to the ground you better be careful <laughs> But yeah, y'all, so I came on here to show y'all. We had a Chinese place. He's ordering the food while I'm sitting in the car. Comment down below and let me know what you like from a Chinese restaurant. Because my thing is, I like um, shrimp lo mein with broccoli. That's what I get, shrimp lo mein with broccoli. That's my favorite. So comment down below and let me know what y'all like from the Chinese restaurants. So, I guess um, once I get home, I'll show y'all all my food that I'm getting. Today, I'm being greedy. And I think next week, I got to get on the ball because you girl need to lose this stomach real bad. I need to lose some weight. I need to at least lose about 20 pounds. The stomach gotta go. But yeah. So, um. 
Yeah, I ain't really been nowhere. Just rode around. Went to go see a few people. Um, yeah, I think, matter of fact, I can't even go home and lay down. I need to wash because we're supposed to be going out of town for the 4th of July. Yeah, we always dipping, dipping, dipping. <laughs> um, tomorrow, I think I get my nails done. Yeah, tomorrow I got a nail appointment. So, yeah, I'm going to show y'all. Yeah, I'm going to take y'all along with me, even though you've been along with me. I don't know how many times that I brought y'all along, but, yeah. So, when I get home, I'll pull y'all back up and let the girls see what's on my plate and what I got to eat. Okay, y'all. So, we got some Wendy's. We're going to try the, um, the nuggets. So, I have garlic parmesan. Garlic Parmesan. Now you got. Let me see. Oh, his looks hot, spicy hot. Oh, and he got a baked potato. <laughs> We got a baked potato with some chili on it. So I'm about to open this and let y'all see. Parmesan. So I'm gonna let y'all know how it tastes when I'm done. Cause y'all not about to watch me eat. So I'll be back. your girl Shanika back with another video if you're new here thank you thank you thank you for subscribing and taking the time out to you know subscribe to my channel or if you're repeating subscriber thank you still thank y'all for showing your girl some love I just came and got my nails done same color okay back this the same place I come Wow. Um, don't understand why nails is so high, but whatever. I'm about to start doing press ons because when I tell you $58 just for a fill in and two broken nails, <laughs> you can tell life is going, it's, it's crazy. But anyway, y'all, I just wanted to start this vlog off and saying happy Monday, good morning, good morning, and thank y'all for, you know, hanging with your girl. But I need y'all to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, 
comment, you know, I talk back with you and share and hit that notification bell so you can know when I upload a video each and every time. But anyway, y'all, let me get to the house and I be back. All right, y'all, I'm home. Just got to the house. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. No. But yeah, so I don't know what I got planned today. So we're just going to go with the flow. And we just see what today brings us. So I will see y'all later. Like I said, it don't cost nothing to hit that like button. It don't cost nothing to subscribe. It don't cost anything. So, hang with your girl today. We're about to see what today may bring. Be back in a little bit. Look a bit greedy. <laughs> The big so yeah y'all, it's your girl Shanika. Coming to let y'all know Woody Wings in New Haven. If you're ever in Connecticut area, come to Woody Wings. Hey y'all, what's going on? I came to do a video today of these. If y'all do know, you can fry these. These off call, it would be called fried green tomatoes. So right now I just took them out the garden, so I'm about to clean them. Clean it with this, y'all. So right now, y'all, I'm just cleaning them. I'm just gonna let it um, sit for a while. Clean it, let it sit for a minute or two, and I'll be back with the video. Okay, y'all. So I'm gonna season my tomatoes with this, if y'all could see it. And some slappy mama. Hold on. Okay, y'all. So I'm about to clean the tomatoes. Okay, 
on so it can get hot. And these came out the garden. My dad did a garden this year. I usually do it but I wasn't in the mood. So he did it this year. I'm going to show you how the garden too. So what I'm about to do now, I'm about to season it. Left your mama. Then I just rub it in the flour. it in my grease. I'm going to show you how once I get them in a pan. It's hot, y'all.
And what I use to brittle my um, tomatoes is chicken brittle. Yep, so that's what I use. You can use anything that you want to use, but that's what I use. About to start taking them out. Flip them over one more time. Flip it over one more time, and I'm gonna go ahead and flower the other ones so they can be ready to go in. So yeah, y'all, this is the fried green tomatoes. I have already taken a bite. I took a bite, so I'm going to take a bite with y'all. I like mine's crunchy, so that's why if y'all see it like this, because I like mine's crunchy. So, they really don't sell green tomatoes in Connecticut, so... The only way that I can get fried green tomatoes is we grow tomatoes in the yard. So, I've been eating fried green tomatoes like since I was little. But yeah, we'll get you some fried green tomatoes, seize them, and fry them. They're good. All right, y'all. I need to go ahead. And end this video out because I needed to um, go ahead and upload it. So I would like for y'all to hit that like button, subscribe, comment, and share. And hit the post notification bell so you will know when I upload each and every time. So y'all have a good day. Peace.